It would be anchored into rock and then pull a ship ashore, you could pull a ship offshore. Oh, yes. Hidden beneath the restless waves and lush, untamed foliage of Oak Island lies a treasure that has taunted explorers for centuries. A treasure said to be so immense that it could rewrite history itself. For a long time, the idea of finding incredible wealth and secret items on Oak Island has attracted both treasure hunters and history experts. Even though many tries were made to reveal the island's mysteries, the result often ended in disappointment. But today, something big has come to light that's about to seriously challenge what we know. Come along as we join the Lagina brothers on a journey that tests the limits of human determination and promises revelations that will leave you breathless. Oak Island's Enigmatic History Nestled on the southern shores of Nova Scotia, Canada, lies the captivating Oak Island, a lush, privately owned gem amidst the azure waters of Mahone Bay. A slender causeway links this verdant haven to the mainland, with the quaint rural community of Western Shore gazing upon it from the nearest shore. Just a stone's throw away, the charming village of Chester adds to the island's allure. Oak Island isn't just any island, it's a place steeped in mystery and intrigue. For generations it has beckoned adventurers with tales of hidden treasures and ancient relics. Its story unfolds against the backdrop of Nova Scotia's climate, where sultry summers and icy winters prevail. Fog shrouds these shores for up to 90 days a year, while fierce storms, including nor'easters and hurricanes, threaten the island's tranquility. Exploring the island's heart reveals a rich fabric of temperate broadleaf and mixed forests, known locally as the New England Acadian Forests. Inhabitants of this natural paradise include majestic great blue herons, black guillemots, osprey, and the elusive roseate tern, considered endangered and protected by Canadian authorities. Efforts to safeguard their habitat are underway, even if it means controlling other bird species. Delving into the island's geological history, J.W. Goldthwaite, from the Geological Survey of Canada, mapped Oak Island in 1924. He unveiled its secret as a composite of four majestic drumlins, elongated hills sculpted over millennia by glacial forces. Beneath the layers of till and bedrock, treasures may lie hidden. Two distinct types of bedrock cradle Oak Island. The southeastern part boasts Mississippian Windsor Group limestone and gypsum, while the northwestern region reveals Cambro-Ordovician Halifax Formation Slate. Surprisingly, Oak Island and Mahone Bay were once a lagoon, submerged over 8,000 years ago as glaciers melted and sea levels surged. Intriguingly, saltwater intrusion, possibly due to human influence or a colossal storm, was detected in core samples from the Triangular Swamp, dating back to the late 1300s or early 1400s. The Quest for Oak Island's Riches The allure of Oak Island's hidden riches has captured imaginations since the late 1700s, with tales of Captain Kidd's buried treasures echoing through time. Early excavations remain shrouded in mystery, but legends began taking shape in 1856. Beyond Captain Kidd, Oak Island has been linked to stories of religious artifacts, manuscripts, and even Marie Antoinette's jewels. Skeptics, however, argue that the supposed treasure is nothing more than natural occurrences. A focal point for treasure hunters is the enigmatic Money Pit, believed to be the initial dig site. Situated on the island's eastern side, this pit plunges over 100 feet into the earth. According to local lore, a curious teenager in 1795 stumbled upon a peculiar depression and, with friends, began to unearth a man-made shaft with wooden platforms every 10 feet, descending to a depth of 90 feet. Additionally, the island boasts intriguing formations, like Nolan's Cross, named after a past treasure hunter, and a mysterious triangle-shaped swamp. Activity has buzzed at Smith's Cove, where unusual discoveries, including non-native coconut fiber, have piqued interest. As the years flowed like a river, Explorers couldn't resist the siren call of this mysterious land. They were bewitched by the allure of untold riches waiting to be unearthed and the mysteries begging to be unraveled. Countless souls embarked on quests to crack the island's enigma, but time and again, Oak Island held tight to its secrets. Now, after two centuries of feverish speculation, dashed hopes, and countless failed attempts, 
the impossible has become reality. The fabled Oak Island treasure, shrouded in legend and whispered about in hushed tones, has yielded its secrets. It was two brothers, Rick and Marty Lagina, who stood on the precipice of history, gazing upon the treasure that had eluded so many. Their names will forever be etched into the story of Oak Island, a tale of patience, perseverance, and the triumph of human curiosity. The Lagina Brothers' Epic Odyssey The saga of the Lagina Brothers unfolds as an enthralling narrative of unyielding determination, hope, and ceaseless curiosity, all centered around the enigma of Oak Island. This is not just a tale, it's an expedition that will unravel the island's ancient secrets. Fueled by an insatiable fascination, the Lagina brothers didn't merely scratch the surface, they plunged headlong into a deep reservoir of research. Their quest unveiled evidence and fragments of forgotten civilizations that once thrived in this very place. Imagine wandering through the remnants of a long-lost world, feeling the whispers of history at every step. Their extraordinary pursuit of treasure became a televised odyssey, captivating audiences worldwide through the History Channel's epic show, The Curse of Oak Island. The world watched as they delved into the island's depths, guided by a map of curiosity. With a dazzling array of tools, techniques, and fearless divers at their disposal, the Lagina brothers toiled tirelessly, meticulously sifting through centuries of soil and sediment to unearth the truth. This wasn't a mere scavenger hunt, it was a meticulous detective story. Their efforts yielded treasures that sparked the imagination. Ancient pottery, cryptic coins, remnants of wooden platforms, whispering tales of long-gone structures, dusty old documents, and cryptic codes hinting at secrets known only to a chosen few. These artifacts weren't just historical relics, they were keys to a forgotten past. Yet, Oak Island was a formidable adversary. Despite their triumphs, the elusive treasure they sought remained elusive. The early chapters of their journey were laced with heartache and frustration, but they refused to yield to the island's stubborn secrets. From Roman Sword to Templar Coin During their third season of exploring, something remarkable happened. They were digging a deep hole, and then, deep down in the earth, they found something incredible. It was an ancient sword used in Roman ceremonies. This wasn't just any sword, it was a sword that gave them new hope. Why, you ask? Well, because finding this sword hinted at something amazing. It suggested that Romans might have come to Oak Island way before Christopher Columbus's famous journey to the Americas. Can you believe that? The history of Oak Island might be even more ancient than we thought, but they couldn't jump to conclusions just yet. They needed to be sure that the sword was really from that time. So they had to do more investigations to check its authenticity. As they kept on searching, they found something else that was mind-blowing. A coin! But not just any coin. This one had the symbol of the Knights Templar on it. You know that secretive group from medieval times. Finding this coin made them wonder if the Knights Templar might have been on Oak Island too. It was like uncovering a piece of a mysterious puzzle. But the surprises didn't stop there. As they kept digging and sifting through the dirt, they found pieces of ancient pottery and items from different ancient cultures. It was like a treasure trove of history. The island's past turned out to be incredibly rich and diverse, full of hidden secrets just waiting to be discovered. The Map That Led to Treasure Fueled by the success of their third season, the Lagina brothers charged into the fourth season with an unwavering spirit, ready to face new challenges head-on. Their unwavering determination led them to stumble upon a remarkable find. An exquisitely crafted French map, an ancient relic that had weathered the sands of time since 1647. This map was no ordinary artifact. It whispered of hidden treasures and held the secrets of a possible connection to the enigmatic Freemasons in their relentless pursuit of Oak Island's concealed riches. Eager to decode the intricate web of symbols and cryptic messages woven into this historical map, they enlisted the expertise of none other than Zena Halpern, a celebrated historian and a sea voyage connoisseur. Her involvement infused a captivating layer of mystery into their quest as she meticulously unraveled led the map's arcane secrets. 
Xena's profound knowledge hinted that the map might be a replica of an even older source, possibly charting the course of Freemasons on a quest for untold wealth. Her insights left the Lagina brothers in awe, and they welcomed her with open arms, confident that her wisdom would pave the way to the legendary treasure they had dreamt of for so long. With a unique blend of ancient relics, enigmatic maps, and Xena's profound wisdom, their expedition promised to be a thrilling odyssey, filled with unexpected twists and turns. Their relentless mission was to unveil the island's well-guarded mysteries and lay bare the concealed treasure that had ignited the passions of adventurers for countless generations. Their determined journey continued, and as they ventured forth, a curious discovery emerged. A rubber boot with intriguing ties to the work of none other than Franklin Roosevelt. This unexpected find ignited their enthusiasm and spurred them on to meticulously comb every inch of the island, fueled by the hope of stumbling upon more substantial leads. Their tireless efforts were soon rewarded with a revelation, an abundance of wood that seemed to bring them ever closer to the elusive origins of the treasure, a tantalizing step forward in their quest for Oak Island's most coveted secrets. Oak Island's Time-Traveling Artifacts in their quest on Oak Island, the team stumbled upon a true gem, a precious piece of glittering gold hidden away for ages. This glittering discovery set their minds racing with wild theories, wondering if they were tracing the very footsteps of explorers from way back in 1909. With hearts pounding and anticipation building, they watched as the B4C shaft was meticulously excavated fervently hoping it would guide them to a chamber bursting with treasures or a vault concealed from the world, bringing them one step closer to the mythical wealth they had been chasing all along. Their conviction that they were on the right path grew stronger as they uncovered ancient wooden tunnels and found astonishingly high levels of gold and silver. They felt as if they were inching ever closer to the heart of this baffling enigma, the original money pit. Their relentless pursuit led them to more fascinating discoveries. Pieces of aged wood and an iron fastener, possibly harking back to the 1700s or even an earlier era. Each newfound artifact added another intricate piece to the puzzle that was Oak Island's cryptic history and the elusive treasure that had remained tantalizingly out of reach for centuries. The climax of their journey was imminent they stood on the precipice of unlocking Oak Island's long-guarded secrets, their hearts brimming with hope and determination. Generations of explorers and adventurers had been captivated by this elusive prize, and now they believed they were the ones who would finally unveil the hidden riches. Their journey had been an arduous one, filled with unexpected twists and daunting challenges, yet they persevered with an unshakable resolve. They knew with unwavering certainty that they were now closer than ever to unraveling the mystery that had been veiled in secrecy for an eternity. Yet, in the heart of the Money Pit region, they encountered an enigmatic hurdle at a depth of 80 feet within the TF-1 shaft. A colossal boulder loomed in their path, a formidable obstacle preventing them from extracting their precious discoveries. Nevertheless, even in the face of adversity, they unearthed fascinating relics, fragments of ancient wood, and a weathered rubber boot. A meticulous investigation revealed that this boot had its roots in a Canadian rubber company from the years 1908 or 1909. The mere mention of these dates ignited a fervent speculation about its link to Franklin Delano Roosevelt's team during their relentless pursuit of the Money Pit's age-old secrets. Unveiling the Secrets of the Money Pit In the B4C shaft, a remarkable find stirred their curiosity. A rugged iron spike, a testament to human craftsmanship, possibly dating back centuries. The seasoned excavation crew descended deep into the earth, reaching a depth of approximately 130 feet, where they encountered a solid bedrock barrier. This geological obstacle hinted at the end of their seasonal digging, casting a shadow of doubt on their treasure-seeking efforts. However, the team refused to succumb to discouragement. Instead, they remained steadfast in their resolve, remaining open to adopting cutting-edge technologies that might aid their quest. Their conviction in the presence of untold riches, buried beneath the island's soil, was their driving force. 
In their relentless pursuit of Oak Island's fabled treasure, the Lagina brothers and their dedicated team sought the guidance of Carmen Legg, a true blacksmithing virtuoso. Legg's expertise was enlisted to unravel the mysteries surrounding the Iron Spike's origins and age. Upon meticulous examination, Legg unveiled a stunning revelation. The Iron Spike likely played a role in the original construction of the Money Pit, further shrouding the site in an enigma. Undaunted by the challenges that lay ahead, the team's unwavering determination continued to propel them forward. With each new discovery, whether it was a weathered rubber boot or this intriguing iron artifact, their excitement mounted. These findings brought them closer to uncovering the long-buried secrets of Oak Island, intensifying their anticipation of finally laying hands on the elusive treasure. The team comprehended the historical importance of these relics, realizing the potential they held in unlocking Oak Island's enigmatic past. With bated breath, they eagerly anticipated the unveiling of the island's next hidden surprises, ready to embrace whatever secrets lay in store for them. Oak Island's Intriguing Underwater Discoveries Embarking on their daring journey into the waters surrounding Oak Island, the intrepid Lagina brothers, joined by their dedicated team, employed a sophisticated magnetometer. This cutting-edge device had the remarkable ability to detect hidden metallic objects lurking beneath the water's surface. As their vessel ventured further, they were met with intriguing and perplexing signals, most notably in the vicinity of the enigmatic Frog Island. These signals hinted at the tantalizing possibility of an ancient shipwreck, shrouded in centuries-old mystery and maritime lore. Determined to unravel the secrets of the deep, the team meticulously devised a plan for a non-invasive investigation, involving an array of high-tech cameras and state-of-the-art scanning devices. Their goal was to secure permission to explore further, unearth artifacts, and illuminate the story of human activity in these waters. In a dramatic underwater expedition, diver extraordinaire Tony Sampson and the renowned underwater archaeologist Dr. Lee Spence joined forces to confirm the presence of a massive metallic object concealed beneath the ocean floor. However, their quest was not without challenges. The murky conditions, veiled by layers of silt and tangled vegetation, obstructed their attempts to gain a clear view. Undaunted by adversity, they boldly extended their search area, revealing more tantalizing hints of a potential shipwreck, its details obscured by rugged rocks and the lush embrace of kelp forests. The team, with bated breath and anticipation, eagerly awaited the green light to excavate waves. Meanwhile, the ever-resourceful metal detection maestro Gary Drayton and the indefatigable treasure hunter Michael John zeroed in on Lot 8, a portion of Oak Island steeped in intrigue and rife with astonishing discoveries. The ground-penetrating radar, a veritable modern-day treasure map, unveiled a colossal metallic anomaly, further fueling the team's fascination with this location. Their findings didn't stop there they stumbled upon a meticulously crafted stone pathway, undoubtedly man-made, and a precious garnet gemstone. These revelations sparked wild speculations, weaving connections to the storied Knights Templar and the fabled Ark of the Covenant. Driven by an insatiable thirst for answers, the team fervently sought additional clues to corroborate their daring theories. With each discovery, their collective excitement swelled like a rising tide carrying them deeper into the heart of the Oak Island mystery. Yet amid all the anticipation and enthusiasm, a lingering specter of uncertainty loomed large. The quest for a permit to proceed with their ambitious excavation efforts remained shrouded in suspense, an unpredictable twist in this captivating tale of exploration and adventure. Journey Through Oak Island's Digital Labyrinth while the intrepid Oak Island exploration team delved deeper into their mysterious quest, Rick Lagina and his dedicated crew found themselves in the heart of the interpretive center. Here, amidst an arsenal of cutting-edge imaging technology, they embarked on a captivating journey of discovery, driven by a burning desire to unravel the enigmatic secrets concealed within the island's very core. As the digital wizardry unfolded, revealing a possible parchment waiting to tell its tale, the team's excitement soared. Each pixel and line on the screen held the promise of unearthing more tantalizing clues, like pieces of a puzzle destined to unveil Oak Island's hidden narratives. 
Yet the plot thickened as they navigated this digital labyrinth. In a twist of fate, their virtual odyssey led them to stumble upon a relic from a bygone era, a replica of a cannon straight out of the 16th century. The dimensions of this awe-inspiring find perfectly match the cannonballs of yesteryears, igniting speculation within the team. Could this ancient artillery have been transported to the island with the solemn duty of guarding something of monumental importance? With bated breath, the researchers peered into the past, piecing together the puzzle. Their conviction grew stronger, like a well-forged cannon, that this artifact's presence bore a connection to the intricate network of wooden tunnels they had painstakingly uncovered, as well as the astonishing concentrations of silver and gold that seemed to glisten just beneath the island's surface. In this pivotal moment, the team's determination swelled. The cannon was not just an artifact, it was a key to Oak Island's rich and enigmatic history, a symbol of their unyielding quest to unearth its deepest secrets. Now it's time for today's subscriber pick. It's time for today's topic. Speculations abound regarding the unearthing of the long-awaited treasure from the enigmatic depths of Oak Island's soil, attributed to the diligent efforts of the Legina brothers. But is it possible? Could this be the treasure that has evaded explorers for generations? The tale of Oak Island is a captivating centuries-old mystery that has fascinated adventurers and history enthusiasts alike. As we delve into this intriguing story, we are left with a trail of intriguing questions. Could Oak Island, wrapped in fog and enigma, truly hold the secrets to untold treasures that might reshape history? How far will the Legina brothers and their dedicated team go in their relentless pursuit of Oak Island's elusive mysteries? Whether or not Captain Kidd's treasure still resides there, the mystique of Oak Island's history will continue to seize our imaginations, leaving us eagerly awaiting the next chapter in this extraordinary journey. Let us know what you think about what we just showed you. Tracing Secrets from Portugal to Oak Island Fueled by their burning curiosity, Rick Lagina and his intrepid team embarked on a thrilling adventure to Quinta da Regalera a captivating ancient palace nestled in the heart of Portugal, its roots tracing back to the early 1900s. Within the enchanting walls of this historic palace, they stumbled upon a revelation of astonishing proportions. It was here that the enigmatic Knights Templar once held sway, conducting their cryptic Masonic and Templar rituals. Their explorations led them to a mesmerizing initiation well nestled on the property. To their amazement, this well boasted a grandeur of nine levels, echoing the fabled nine tiers of the original money pit concealed on the enigmatic Oak Island. This breathtaking connection left the team awash with questions, pondering the well's intricate design and its tantalizing potential link to the ever-elusive Oak Island mystery, with its legendary money pit at the core. As the team delved deeper into their investigations, they stumbled upon perplexing voids concealed within the palace's depths. These mysterious empty spaces hinted at the possibility of a concealed treasure vault shrouded in secrecy for centuries. Their findings gave birth to a riveting theory. Could this initiation well be a meticulously crafted replica of the Money Pit? This tantalizing notion hinted at an unprecedented connection between these two ancient enigmas, setting the stage for an adventure of unparalleled proportions. Tracing their legacy from Fontacata to Tomar To explore these fascinating ideas in more depth, the team embarked on a journey to Portugal that was filled with excitement. Their destination was the enchanting Church of Fontacata, a place steeped in history and legends. This church, nestled in Portugal's heart, held stories dating back to the ancient times of the Knights Templar. Imagine standing amidst the aged stones and intricate architecture of the Church of Fontarcada, feeling a connection to the past. This very land was thought to have been bestowed upon the valiant Knights Templar, an order renowned for their courage and mystique. The air was thick with the sense of history as the team delved into the secrets this church harbored. As their eyes roamed over the church's walls and enigmatic corners, they were met with a sight that sent ripples of excitement through them. Symbols and markings, reminiscent of those found on the enigmatic Oak Island, adorned the surfaces. It was as if the echoes of a distant puzzle were reverberating across time and space. 
A whirlwind of discussions ignited like sparks catching fire in a dark forest. The team debated the significance of these symbols. Were they clues, keys, or mere coincidences? Could these enigmatic marks link the threads of history, connecting the Templars' distant past with the enigma of Oak Island? The realization dawned that their quest for answers was far from over. It was merely taking them deeper. This realization pointed them towards Tomar, a place brimming with echoes of the Templars' enigmatic history. Plans were set in motion for a pilgrimage to this historical haven, a journey that promised to unveil even more mysteries. The Knights Templar, these fabled figures of the past, had etched their mark on history through tales of bravery and opulence. As knights who safeguarded pilgrims on treacherous journeys, they had amassed treasures and knowledge that echoed through the corridors of time. Their headquarters, the Convento de Cristo, stood as a fortress of their legacy, a place where whispers of their clandestine activities still lingered. With the passage of time, the Knights Templar transformed into the Order of Christ, shrouding their enigmas in an ever-deepening cloak of secrecy. It was as if they had constructed a labyrinth of intrigue, daring future generations to decipher their puzzles and reveal the hidden truths that lay within. The Aged Parchment's Revelation as they continued on their journey, something remarkable unfolded before them. An old parchment surfaced, carrying the names William Chapel and Frederick Blair. This aged document held more than just names. It held a captivating story from the 15th century. This tale spun the yarn of an exhilarating exploration, recounting the unearthing of a concealed chamber whispered to the brim with treasures beyond imagination. This revelation wasn't just a nugget of information. It was a key that unlocked a chest of intrigue and wonder, compelling them to plumb the depths even further, revealing the shadowy history of Oak Island. Each footfall they took brought them nearer to a truth that had long been veiled, a truth that could rewrite the annals of history and unearth secrets buried for ages. With a fierce resolve and unyielding optimism, they pressed on, venturing deeper into the heart of the island. Their eagerness to untangle the ancient riddles was a fire that blazed within them. They were explorers on a mission to breathe life into long-forgotten mysteries, to bring the past into the light after centuries of dormancy. Deciphering the Ancient Manuscript The dedicated team delved into an ongoing exploration that hinted at something truly captivating. It was like piecing together a puzzle from the past, revealing the potential existence of medieval knights who preferred to remain shrouded in secrecy. These knights, it was believed, might have played a major yet mysterious role in the island's history. As the determined crew continued their relentless pursuit on Oak Island, their efforts unearthed more than they had imagined. The soil gave up its secrets, hinting at a history filled with maritime intrigue. Among the remarkable findings were fragments of wood that seemed to have once been part of ancient ships. These discoveries lent weight to Scott Clark's theory, providing tangible evidence to his supposition. But it wasn't just the land that yielded its mysteries. The swamp, too, held tantalizing potential. Fred Nolan, a member of the team, made an astonishing discovery, artifacts that bore the unmistakable hallmarks of a seafaring past. The very idea that these murky waters might cradle even more precious treasures ignited fervent speculation. With each new revelation, the team inched closer to a momentous breakthrough. It was as if they were piecing together a forgotten tale, and every artifact was a word in that story. The prize at stake was staggering, the rewriting of history itself, and the unveiling of the long-lost fortunes that lay concealed beneath the island's surface for ages. At the center of this quest were the Lagina brothers, whose unwavering determination caught the imagination of people around the globe. Their pursuit became a rallying point for adventurers, scholars, and those who dared to dream. Amid the feverish treasure hunt, an unexpected marvel emerged, an ancient bookbinding, its pages whispering of secrets. The cryptic hints within ignited a spark of curiosity that led them down a winding path, eventually revealing an expansive age-old manuscript penned in a language unknown. The weight of the moment was not lost on them. Recognizing the potential significance of this enigmatic message, they embraced the challenge with courage. Deciphering the text was akin to unlocking a door to a world long gone. 
Their hopes soared as they delved into translation, yearning for the key to unlock the whereabouts of the fabled riches concealed in the profound recesses of the island. Conquering the Unconquerable In the midst of it all, the captivating journey embarked upon by the Legina brothers and their intrepid team traces its origins back to a youthful fascination that gripped Rick Legina at the tender age of ten. It all began with an unexpected encounter with a colossal granite boulder in Kingsford, which ignited within him a fervent dream, a dream of uncovering long-lost treasures concealed deep within. This singular passion that took root in his heart during those early years would go on to define his entire existence, evolving into an enduring odyssey of boundless adventure. And so it was that destiny led them to the enigmatic Oak Island. Their expedition expanded to include the remarkable presence of Dan Blankenship, a seasoned explorer whose very name had become synonymous with the exploration of Nova Scotia. Blankenship, a living legend in his own right, brought with him a treasury of experience, adding invaluable depth to their quest. In their journey, Blankenship and his son emerged as pivotal figures, unraveling the island's mysteries one by one. They uncovered meticulously crafted booby traps cunningly concealed within the money pit's depths and unearthed cryptic stones at the enigmatic Smith's Cove, infusing the quest with a palpable sense of complexity and exhilaration. Yet their path was far from easy. Obstacles of every conceivable nature stood resolutely in their way, most notably the relentless intrusion of water flooding their excavation site. However, the team's indomitable spirit remained unshaken. A true breakthrough materialized when Craig Tester, one of their own, ingeniously devised a solution, freezing the encroaching waters. This innovative approach breathed new life into their mission, allowing them to forge ahead with renewed determination. Every stride they took, every discovery they made, drew them ever closer to the answers they sought with unwavering dedication. And although the fabled trove of treasure still lay hidden, their shared passion, which resonated with so many, kindled a flame of hope that persevered. A hope that someday, the secrets of Oak Island would yield to their relentless pursuit and its concealed treasures would finally bask in the brilliant light of day. Do you believe Captain Kidd's treasure could still be hidden on Oak Island? Share your thoughts in the comments 